Hi, my Libra and Libra Rising friends. Sandra from ForYourChi.com here. We're here today to do your full-on career outlook for 2022. We have good news here. The year ends much better than it began. Okay, so let's get into this. And if you want to look at your love life for 2022 or your money, follow me in the links below. Now, the first quarter of 2022, you have memories of love. So this tells me that you are reminiscent of times past. You are thinking of when it was better, Libra. Now, you have weight here. So this tells me not to make any major moves with your career if you can help it. If you can't help it, I completely understand. I had to pour myself a drink for this, Libra, for your readings. Okay. How are you feeling about this? Well, you're not feeling too bad with harmony and warm and fuzzy feelings, but the advice card is trust. You know that you need to trust in what the universe is doing and going to do for you, Libra. So keep the faith. You must keep the faith. Now, the second quarter, we pulled the devil card. So this tells me, make sure, pay attention to who shows up on the scene, what opportunities you're getting, you know, now this could be you working, certainly, but if it's you working, it's you either being a workaholic or working for a workaholic, or you could have a boss who's an addict or a coworker who's an addict that's causing a problem. How are you going to deal with this? The advice card from the angels is listen to your intuition, point blank, Okay. They're trying to tell you what to do about this here. And this could also be a Capricorn too in the mix because the devil, re devil card represents a Capricorn sign. Third quarter here is destiny. Here's where I'm talking, where the wheel of fortune turns in your favor, Libra. Okay, so, and, and we have the abundance card. So this means that things are starting to make a change for the better. Thank you, universe, for that, right? And that the money in your treasure ship is starting to come in third quarter. Excellent, excellent. And it ends on a positive note. I can't wait to see what your money spread looks like. You pulled the biggest money card in this spread. This card means that you are reaping the harvest of the good seeds that you have previously sown. And that you are to remain positive. I love it. We're going to take a sneak peek at the um, 2023 year. You did pull sacral shocker, which tells me you're going to be in a state of wanting or desiring at the beginning of January. You know, it doesn't necessarily mean that that's a bad thing. I would definitely... Um, factor this into your new year's resolutions for 2023 okay um the advice card for the beginning of 2023 is choose a new direction so although you do have where the wheel of fortune takes a turn here for you in your favor i feel like this is going to be a temporary um positive shift and that the beginning of 2023 is going to bring you something brand new as it should uh, because we are in an environment of constant change, let's face it. So there's going to be something in the interim that you're going to do that's going to bring in money. Be thankful for that. And then the next thing remains to be unseen, but it's going to be something brand new. Okay, so let's look at your money and your love reading. I can't wait to see what 2022 brings in store for you, Libra. Many blessings.